My name is Jacques Rodrigue, and we're at Rodrigue Studio in the French Quarter in New Orleans, Louisiana. My family and I, along with our co-curator, E. John Bullard, Director Emeritus of the New Orleans Museum of Art, are presenting George Rodrigue a memorial retrospective until January 2015. Dad always said that this was his dream gallery space, and he designed and engineered everything here to show off his work in the best way possible. And usually in a gallery, you would only see work from the last five years. However, in shows like this, you really get to understand Dad's history as an artist and exactly where the Blue Dog came from. Each wall label here gives you personal insight into his thought process because they are taken from my stepmom, Wendy Rodrigues, blog and book, Musings of an Artist's Wife. On display are some of the earliest paintings from the 1960s, including the first painting he ever sold. Then, as you walk through the exhibit, you begin to understand why he first started to paint the oak tree, the Louisiana landscape, and the Cajuns. Dad always said that if he wasn't from Louisiana, he never would have been a painter in the first place. But because of his love for this area, he took it upon himself to visually interpret the history of the Cajuns on campus, showing them cut out and pasted and glowing white with their culture inside of them. When you walk around, you then understand the connection of the Cajuns to Blue Dog. In 1984, he was commissioned to paint a book of Cajun ghost stories. And one of the stories was about a Lou Garou, a Cajun werewolf dog. He used an old picture of his dog Tiffany, painted her bluish grayish under the full moon, and it was the public that called this Lugaroo the blue dog. And you can see some of the earliest blue dogs in existence here. Also here is the large scale Lugaroo, the first painting in 25 years without an oak tree, and the true beginning of the blue dog series. Plus. Paintings done from Neiman Marcus and Xerox, and even paintings completed just this past year. Lastly, the exhibit features early work from art school at the University of Louisiana at Lafayette and at Art Center College of Design in Los Angeles. Plus, you will see memorabilia from my father's home, jewelry, old photographs, his boots, and sculptures. We are presenting this exhibit in New Orleans and two other retrospectives in our Lafayette, Louisiana and Carmel, California galleries for all of 2014. For the entire year, these spaces are dedicated to the life of George Rodrigue. I'm George Rodrigue. I was born in New Iberia, Louisiana in 1944. And I've lived in New Orleans and Louisiana all my life. I've been painting paintings for 40 years. The first part of this show shows you all the early Cajun paintings and then all of a sudden you see early blue dog paintings which relates to the Cajuns. And that's what the show is about, a continuing progression of uh, my life of Cajuns, blue dogs, bodies, and hurricanes. It's me and it's Louisiana and how I interpreted Louisiana.